Grant Hill and Richard Jefferson. Allie LaForce will be our reporter from the sideline. And of course, this is the first they're seeing of Boston. We see these teams face off only twice a year. Last year, each one won. And who knows, if you want to look all the way ahead to the finals, it's possible these teams can see each other there. So both teams looking to make a statement in their first meeting of the season. Jason Tatum. Hits the trifecta. And Grant, the news for the Celtics over the summer, moved on from Smart in order to acquire Porzingis. Yeah, the team wanted to get bigger, and Porzingis gives them that. Hard to lose a player like Smart, but the Celtics feel their guards can fill that void. Nobody's going to catch Brown in the open court like that. Nobody. Here's Curry. Uses the glass on the layup. Curry's got five now. When you're trying to stop a guy like this, you have to match his intensity level. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. First personal foul. Oh, getting the hoop and the harm. That's tremendous body control from Brown. Richard, we saw a new look for Jalen Brown in 2023, but injury forced him to don a mask. Yeah, face masks are kind of infamous right now. Some guys struggle with them, some guys are defined by it. Didn't seem to bother Brown that much, I will give him that. Here's Curry. Again, Golden State. Starting to find his rhythm. He's cooking, and he knows it. Yeah, when he gets engaged this early in the game, it's bad news for the defense. He can roll this start throughout the rest of the game. And how great are they playing? Four for four shooting to start this one. They get the rebound. The kick out to Wiggins. Pass to Curry. From behind the arc. Rebounded by the Celtics. Inside. Here's Williams. And here's Brown for three. And the Celtics another three. Three points. When you let a team knock down that many threes, you know you're likely to be on the wrong side of a run. And here's Curry for three. Drops in the three. Ten points for him. Can't blame the deficit on him. He's been scoring at will this period. How about those nifty moves from Tatum? So crafty with the rock. The three from Curry. Misfires there. Four for six in the game now. And so it's Williams with it. He brings it up for the Boston Celtics. Six-point lead. It's stolen by Green. On the wing, Green. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. Looney inside. Pass to Curry. Shot clock at six. Fires for three. That won't go either for Curry. And here are the Celtics. Here's Tatum. And finished off by Tatum. Oh, this is how aggressive Tatum is. Excellent job of getting to the rim and a finish. Just light work. Fast break. Here come the Celtics. White with it. Now Wiggins defending. The kick out to White. Pass to Horford. On the wing, Tatum. Shoots it from the corner. Yes, great play by Horford to set him up. Tatum's got nine. That's three buckets in a row off assist. And the Warriors call time here. Celtics making a switch here. Here's Curry. He's got 10. Down low. 
Here's Looney. And the layup falls. Just an unselfish play from Curry. Always ready to move the ball and his body to help an open shooter. Outside Tatum. Right side, Porzingis. Six on the shot clock. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. And even in a short time in the NBA, Tatum has become the model wing for the modern NBA, RJ. Yeah, he does everything so well. Shooting, defense, playmaking, you name it, this man has it. He gives you everything you want and need in that wing position. What strikes me about Jason Tatum is really his versatility. He's got any move for any situation that you throw at him. His moves have moves. His counters have counters. That is a man that can finish plays or make them. Hey, if you can't block it, sending him to the line can be the next best thing. You know, when you look back on Stephen Curry's career, it's still amazing that he fell to the seventh pick of the draft. You think a few teams regret that one, B.A.? <laughs> look, as great as a shooter as he is, teams were scared off by his build because he didn't have that typical NBA strong body. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. When you want an emphatic finish, Brown is the man you are looking for. He does not waste opportunities like that. And Brogdon with the stuff. They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. They came out swinging, really setting the tone on offense, and the opposition has not been able to respond. And so it's Boston. 